Microsoft finally enters the era of cloud computing with their brand new release, Windows 365. This opened up a wide range of possibilities for businesses, saving both their money and resources. This virtualization service grants users access to Windows desktop and applications regardless of their device, platform, and location. Before venturing any further, let's take a brief look at how cloud computing actually works. As the name suggests, cloud computing means accessing information remotely or via a virtual space. Several cloud computing firms provide this service where a user can store applications and files in a remote server and access them through the internet. Having remote access to the system enables a user to work from a remote location without being physically present in a specific place. Microsoft Windows 365 is no exception at all. Rather, it is faster, more enhanced, and has a plethora of perky features to offer for enterprises and businesses. Businesses will gain new benefits from Microsoft's Windows 365 services, including lower costs and easier administration, hence improved productivity. There is no need to host systems and applications locally as Windows 365 streams all of this data and information to the cloud. This not only makes the client experience smooth, but also negates any hardware requirement for boosting up performance. Another awesome thing about Windows 365 is that a firm can tweak the configuration settings of each individual employee according to their needs and demands of storage, memory, and processing power. This further cuts down costs and wastage of resources. Depending on the size of the company, Windows 365 initially comes in two subscription options. Windows 365 Business is targeted towards firms having up to 300 employees and Windows 365 Enterprise which is for much larger organizations. Depending on the storage and performance demand, you can get Windows 365 in 12 sets of configurations for your business or enterprise. The cheapest configuration comes in at about $20 per month and includes a single virtual CPU, 2 gigs of RAM, and 64 gigs of storage. This package is ideal for call center employees as they will be good to go for running a limited number of applications and processing power. On the other side of the spectrum, clients who perform processor-heavy tasks such as software engineers and creatives can get the maximum configuration setting with 8 virtual CPUs, 32 gigs of RAM, and 512 gigs of storage at a monthly expense of $158. Everything aside, Windows 365 does look promising and effective for business and enterprise usage. Although Windows 365 is targeted towards the business segment, we are hoping to see this service offered to the consumer segment in the distant future as well. So that was all about Microsoft's Windows 365. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.